So I just get off the phone with Chrissy Teigen, and she's calling me up. First of all, I'm like, hey, Chrissy, babe, how'd you get my number, right? Who's giving my number out to you? That pisses me off. Number two, Chrissy, I got no beef with you, and because she wants to know why we've got this YouTube war going on. And I'm like, I got no beef with you, but get your husband on the phone. Let's hash this out. So Legend gets on the phone, and let me tell you something, people. That guy's got a smooth voice, right? Like, all the anger that I had, all the confrontation, uh, it went out the window. Because that guy, that guy can talk, and he's so nice. The Tegans and the Legends are just so damn nice. So they invite me to dinner, right? And, uh, no, dude, I don't have dinner with the freaking Tegans and the Legends. I don't. I won't go to dinner with them, and I'll tell you why. Because I'm in a goddamn YouTube war with them. That's why. See, what I noticed... They're weak. They're like, oh, let's be friends. Let's not fight on YouTube. Okay, yeah, blah, 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 blah. And I'm like, oh, okay, okay, Chrissy, John, you want to play this game? Right? You want to play this game, huh? So, I am at war with Chrissy Teigen and John Legend. I don't even know why. I don't. I really don't. I just, uh, I happen to throw her name out. And by the way, this program is synchronous, not asynchronous. So, if you're not paying attention to the earlier episodes, you have no idea why Chrissy Teigen's calling me up no idea. Uh, so anyway, I, I'm, I'm attempting not to have too many bitter feuds with people on the internet. I am, however, I did respond to a post online, um, and I thought it was rather innocuous. I, I had, uh, I responded to a joke that made me giggle. So I send the guy back, uh, uh, I guess it goes to the World Wide Web, a post that says, hey, bud, uh, that made me giggle. Thanks. And then uh, I couldn't help myself. Literally, like seven minutes later, I sent like an all text, all all caps, question marks, exclamation points. What you think you're a fucking comedian now? And the guy's like seventy years old. So I have no idea why I'm doing what I'm doing, why I'm going crazy. This is like Heart of Darkness, and I feel that's the uh, that's the book that Apocalypse Now was based on. Yeah, go read it. The horror. The horror. Anyway, the, the, the further I get away from civilization, society, and interaction with people, i.e. society, the, the more I digress into uh, uh, anarchy. And, and that's the whole theme of the heart of darkness, right? The farther you get away from civilization, the more uncivilized you become. And let me tell you something. That, my friends, uh, if I can be so bold and call you my friends, subscriptors. Let's keep our distance. Uh, that is is the key right there. Uh, and I don't want to go too deep into this, but I am I am I am falling deep into an uncivilized path where anger and aggression uh, um, went out over common sense and uh, and and niceties. So uh, yeah, and the hair didn't grow back. And you know what? I thought it would grow back wider. I mean, immediately I thought it'd grow back. So I'm like four days with this. And every day I look in the mirror and I'm like, you dumb son of a bitch, right? You couldn't wait five minutes to put the clipper guards on. No, 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 no. You got to go no guard offense, all forwards and postmen. It's crazy.